Well, here we go. Gonna make the leap. Going to move on to Mac OS X Ventura. First things first, gotta get a backup. All right, well, before we pull the trigger, let's just get a backup done. Let's make sure that is done, just in case something goes horribly wrong, which I have seen happen before. Okay, well, here we go. So here I am using my phone as my camera. That's uh, pretty cool. You know, it just, it looks really good. Now I've got to just set up on a really dumb tripod, um, just holding it up. It's still got to play around a little bit because of the case I have on. I don't want to, you know, decase it all the time. But there you go. Like that's another camera. But that's one thing you can do with this because it does support some of the cooler features that are part of the you know, the camera app, you can do things like this. So this is pretty cool. Now on your Mac, you just go up to the top, right? And pull down and go to video effects. And then for your camera, this is using portrait mode. So you can see here, it's got that nice blur behind me. I'm still in frame and it's all good. And you can also do this. So this is using center stage. Now I'm sitting down. So not quite as good as it could be, but I'm sitting down, but it is able to pick that up and do all that. So that's uh, not something I'm going to use because I'm going to keep myself in frame. Anyway, I don't want to sort of be out of frame. But yeah, so this is what I was talking about. You do some of this cool stuff with some of my figures behind me. And that's just another thing I can use. Now, it is hard because I'm really just looking at the camera. I can't see anything in my prep here in uh, for my OBS. That's a one drawback to using this as a camera. Usually you put that right on top of the monitor so you can see what the OBS is doing. But for me, that's not how I do it. So this is a start. This is really, this is the openings of what is going to hopefully be something cool stuff. You know, it even could just be, you know, B-roll. I can flip to it with my stream deck and I can just make that work on that. But uh, it's so far, so far, touch wood. Haven't had any problems so far with Ventura other than did not like my stream deck. It kept saying, hey, this is damage, 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 damage. Could not get rid of it. I had to sort of fight in between to get it to the trash, empty the trash, put a new copy of stream deck in and everything was fine. I think it might've been something as simple as code signing, but yeah, it just was maddening. But everything else seems to be working fine so far. So that's sort of first impressions. I, I took the leap and did Ventura. Now what I'm gonna do, as I said, backup, install, backup. So I'm going to get a good backup of this basically fresh install of Ventura on top of my stuff and in case something goes south. And there's the girl taking a shower. So that's what that weird noise is. Sorry about that. Um, the boons of doing this in my basement. But there you go. So that's first steps. I will keep you informed of what's going on. So uh, here we are two days later. This, uh, we've been playing around with Ventura now for a couple of days. I do enjoy continuity camera. I think it's pretty cool. Um, saw the video I just, you know, that just there. And it was all right. I do need to work a little bit on it. And like I said in, in that little segment there, it's weird because I'm looking at the camera here that I'm doing and I can see what I'm doing. Now, granted, I'm looking at the Elgata new face cam pro, which will not have the feedback I need either, other than looking here my OBS to pull it back again. So maybe something you know, I need to get looking at. But 4K60, come on, that's insane. That would be something really cool to upgrade to. Anyway, um, cut a new camera. Very cool. Another very cool thing that I never thought I would use much. I played with it on the iPad because the iPad with iOS 16 does support it with the M1s. Stage Manager. I'm using it on my Mac a lot more than I thought I would. I didn't even turn it on the first day and I thought, well, let's take, oh, that, sure, let's give it a whirl. I use it a lot. On what I'm using here, which I mean, you can't see because I'm just recording, 27 inch monitor here from OBS and then my mail. And then over there, I have a 34 inch monitor that I do my final cut on. And I keep a lot of windows open because I got 32 gig of RAM and I got a uh, M1 Pro processor, well, M1 something processor. And I keep that open. I've got Chrome here. I've got uh, Final Cut and Safari over there and Mail here. And having 
used it a little bit, I think stage manager is more than I thought it was going to be. I like it. You know, the fact I can minimize windows and open windows and they're all there and I can see them. Like right now I'm looking right here on my OBS. I got a couple windows there and it's all good. And I like it. So first impressions, comparing this to my iMac in the office, which is an Intel processor, um, you know, it runs okay, but also is limited by the fact eight gigs of RAM. This has got 32 and this is a silicone processor. I'm pretty happy with this. It's working really well. So in the end for the first week, or first four days, I guess, impressions on this pretty good so far. But again, this is just the first release. This is uh, OS 13, not 13.1.2, where they're going to be little incremental updates. Things are going to get better as they go. So for a first effort, it's pretty good. And I can't say this enough back up then install make sure your backups there there's always the chance something goes south on you and then you're hosed what are you going to do just make your life that much easier spend the extra couple hours getting the backup done if you've never done a backup uh, apple gives you free software all you need is a hard drive you can buy them at walmart you can buy them at costco you can just get a hard drive do your backup do yourself a favor you've got it done there that's the last tip from your apple tech so that's the video for today. That's my first impressions of Ventura. I hope everyone's having a great day. We'll talk to you all later.